this has popped up in your Facebook feed as of late. 13,000 people and counting from across the world liking the page Free Patty, posting pictures like this one. They are rallying, rallying around a dog said to be euthanized for biting a four-year-old boy last month in Manatee County. Well, the owner claiming the child cornered the dog and the dog should be let go. A warning here, the pictures of the bite may be a little bit disturbing to some you're about to see here. Our Christy Post is in Manatee County where they are deciding if the dog will live or die. And while we've been waiting for this decision to be made, Patty has been here at the Animal Service Department in Manatee County. We asked to go see her, but were denied because of the ongoing investigation. But this decision is something people all over the world are waiting on. Say, I really like Patty. Say, that's one of my best friends. If you ask anyone at the pet clinic in Bradenton, they are quick to tell you about Patty. Patty is just the most gentle, loving animal that I think I've ever met. She greets us, she greets Riley, she greets the people, she greets the children. But for the last two months, all people have been greeted with is this picture of the black lab mix instead. I just cannot imagine not saving Patty. Patty's owner, Dr. Paul Gartenberg, says on June 4th, a four-year-old was playing with Patty in his office. The toys were here, and the child was throwing toys, and the babysitter was standing right behind him. That's when the dog bit part of the child's ear. Gartenberg claiming the four-year-old provoked him. There's no place for him to go when he's there. That's it. This is a picture of the injury after the child had to get reconstructive surgery. County officials calling it severe. And according to state law, because it was classified as severe, Patty must be quarantined, then destroyed. The only exception is if the dog was being abused when it bit. The law doesn't say anything about being provoked or what may have been an accident. Right now, the decision is resting in the hands of the Manatee County Attorney's Office. The parents of the kid not commenting. Show your stuff, you know how to do it. While Gartenberg awaits Patty's fate, he has been visiting her every day taking videos like this. Gartenberg says his dog has been shackled before, a stray that came to him with this chain on. He's a survivor, though, my God, he had to live in that and then here, and this must have been heaven for him. And like Rust Freedom in the past, he says the community can help free Patty again. First thing I'm going to do is throw him in the tub and bathe him, <laughs> and then uh, we're going to have a, a party here. Again, next week, the Manatee County Attorney's Office is expected to make a decision. If the dog is to be euthanized, the owner says he will appeal but that could take months. Of course, we will be watching this unfold. For the now, I'm Christy Post.